When using the Tidal Wave Variable Speed Controller, you can control the flow and operating time of any Tidal Wave TW or TT series asynchronous pump wirelessly via remote control or app from your mobile device. Begin by mounting the VSC in the desired location on a wall or post away from direct sunlight using the mounting pockets located on the back of the control box. Remove the VSC from the mounting location and remove the cord cover on the back of the control box. Remove the cord lock and plug in the pump cord into the recessed outlet. Ensure the VSC is within reach of a properly grounded GFCI outlet and the electrical cord of the pump that will be used. Install the cord lock if needed and replace the cord cover. Return the VSC to the mounting location and plug the power cord into a GFCI power outlet. To turn the pump on, press the power button. The word on and flow level will be displayed on the screen. Use the up and down arrows to control the flow. Each time the flow is adjusted, the display will show the flow level for three seconds and then return to the time of day. To turn the pump off, press the power button. The word off and a double zero flow level will be displayed. The VSC will retain the flow setting when powered off. When the power is restored, the VSC will start the pump at full power for three seconds and then return to the previous setting. The VSC is equipped with a time of day clock and start stop timer feature. These do not need to be programmed to operate the VSC. After 10 seconds of inactivity during any part of the programming sequence, the selection will be entered and the VSC will exit the program functions and return to the main clock display. To set the clock, press and hold the set button for three seconds to enter the program functions. The hour will begin to blink. Use the arrows to select the hour. Press the set button and the minutes will begin to blink. Use the arrows to select the minutes. Once you are satisfied with the clock settings, press the set button to enter the timer functions. A small on will be displayed on the left of the screen and a large off will be flashing in the center of the screen. This indicates the start timer is currently off. Press the power button if you want to activate the start timer. The hour will begin to blink. Use the arrows to select the hour. After you have selected the hour, press the set button and the minutes will begin to blink. Use the arrows to select the minutes. When you are satisfied with the program start time, press the set button. A small off will be displayed on the left of the screen and a large off will be flashing in the center of the screen. This indicates the stop timer is currently turned off. Press the power button to activate the stop timer. The hour will begin to blink. Use the arrows to select the hour. After you have selected the hour, press the set button and the minutes will begin to blink. Use the arrows to select the minutes. Once you are satisfied with your selections, wait 10 seconds and the VSC will return to the time of day display, indicating that the programming was entered. If you experience below freezing temperatures, winterizing your VSC is easy. Just unplug and store inside for the winter months. Each VSC includes one remote that allows you to power on, adjust the flow of the pump, and power off. In the event you lose connection or want to control two VSCs from one remote, simply unplug and replug in the VSC control box or boxes and press any button on the remote. To get started, download the application for your phone and tablet on the Google Play Store or App Store. For Apple devices, open Wi-Fi settings on your phone and select the Tidalway VSC Wi-Fi network. You will need to enter the factory password to join the network. Open your Tidalway VSC app. The app will take a few seconds to recognize the Wi-Fi connection. Once connected, you will be able to control the flow of your pump with the up and down arrows and turn your pump on and off using the power button.
Login settings in the drop-down menu allows you to customize your VSC's Wi-Fi network name and password. After clicking Save, you will need to go back to your Wi-Fi settings and log into the new Wi-Fi network. Once connected, you will be able to control the flow of your pump with the up and down arrows and turn your pump on and off using the power button. For Android devices, open the TidalWave VSC app. Select Connect VSC from the drop-down menu. Select the TidalWave VSC Wi-Fi network. Click the back button. The app will take a few seconds to recognize the Wi-Fi connection. Once connected, you'll be able to control the flow of your pump with the up and down arrows and turn your pump on and off using the power button. Login settings in the drop down menu allows you to customize your VSC's Wi Fi network name and password. After clicking Save, you will need to go back to Connect VSC in the drop down menu and log into the new Wi Fi network.